if I try to like steel man the argument uh, that you may face or put myself in the shoes of someone who's very worried about AI water use, I would just say like, look, it just feels bad to see this uh, sort of transformation of our society into something that seems designed to support this technology that I don't like, that doesn't seem that useful to me, and that um, you know I, I was never consulted about. So, like, what's your response to that version of the argument? I guess I want to respond to it with a lot of respect, first of all, because like you know I'm very worried about AI overall, but also a very big fan of AI tools as they currently exist. Like I use chatbots pretty regularly. I have a lot of positive impressions of AI as it currently exists, and I want to try to reach people who don't. Basically, if you think AI is bad, then obviously you should also like generally oppose it using water for the same reason that you should oppose anything else bad that's using water. But that opposition should also come with a sense of proportion of like where the actual water issues are in the country and like. There are a lot of other things I think are bad that use a lot of water, specifically animal agriculture. Um, and like there, I do actually feel a little bit more justified in focusing on that a lot just because it's using such a huge amount of the nation's water. Something like a quarter of your total dietary footprint um, for water comes from like the food that is grown to eventually feed animals and stuff like that. Um, and so in thinking about this, um, I do want people to not not be upset if they don't like AI, but I do want them to at least prioritize like, okay, if I care about water, Will it actually make much of a dent at all if we shut down all AI data centers like tomorrow? Like how much will that, this actually help America's water problems? Um, and my ba basic claim is that it's not really going to make much of a dent compared to a lot of other issues. 